There was an idea to bring together a group of remarkable people to see if we could become something more. school year, we didn't even know that there was anything like 4D simulation or synchro. We thought that in the future we would sit in the office and bother only with papers. But then a new wave of information came. There was an opportunity to do things better, smarter, more responsible. As a first step of our work, we had to find an issue that we could solve. We found out that companies are using outdated methods of determining the length of the technological break. We think that implementation of the smart sensors in the building industry can have a lot of advantages. For example, saving financial resources, shortening of the entire construction process and availability of the data. After choosing of our issues, so we had to choose a BIM model for our project. An interesting example was the construction that stood in a certain stage of development for almost 10 years. We find out that the demolition works was carried out within the existing structure on the site. At the same time, some structures has to be additionally reinforced, for example, pillars. We got the model itself in Revit format. After dividing that model into the parts that are easier to use in Synchro, we had to export these models and then we could easily import them into the Synchro. Of course, we wanted the entire construction process to have a certain level, so we decided to use InfraWorks to simulate the construction environment and building equipment. Subsequently, the InfraWorks model was exported and imported into the Synchro. The time schedule itself was created in the MS project program and exported in XML format, uh, which was imported in Synchro without problems. Uh, Synchro also enabled us to update or synchronize all of imported items. To the import of the Revit models, we found out that we imported these models with some color imperfections, which, is, which was not a problem because we could easily create 3D filters and change these colors as we need. During the assignment of 3D resources to individual tasks, we found out that our tower crane was modeled through all of the ceilings. So we decided to use the subdivision functions to divide these ceilings into the elements that we needed. As we were assigning 3D resources to task, we used mainly manual assignment. We have also tried the option of automate. This option was only applicable for a certain part as the model itself has a flow in labeling. Our work began with the idea of possible automation of the information obtained from smart sensors. These sensors are capable to provide an information about the strength of concrete based on temperature and the construction manager can receive this information real time in order to make the decision. This could be the next step for beam usage in a construction process where smart sensors on vehicles, workers and objects will be connected to BIM in real time. We tested two main methods for this purpose. One method is based on adding information about real-time concrete strength into 3D BIM model and the second is based on modifying time schedule. The sensor server collects the information in Excel spreadsheet. For method where we modify schedule, we connected Excel with MS project. After synchronizing, it appeared also in our 4D model. Method based on modifying 3D model through native format is the platform where the information about real-time concrete strength 
is delivered directly into the 3D model using Excel predefined template or Dynamo script. From this point, it's really easy to export this model. Then after import or synchronize our model, we have a live information about the real-time concrete strength in our synchro simulation. Last year, we tried to connect virtual reality and synchro. This year, we wanted to move it to the next level, so we tested Microsoft HoloLens and plugin for Synchro. We visited a construction of which we had a beam model, tested it, and it works great. At the end, work with Synchro was a great asset for us. Through the Synchro Academy, we have acquired basic knowledge, which we have further developed in our world. The work in Synchro was fun and we enjoyed the project.